Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome to a very stormy, rainy Dave the Diver. In the last video, we set up the... Did we set up the farm last time around? I can't quite remember. I'm very tired. <laughs> Today, we're going to have a low-key video, okay? Because I am I am not awake right now. <laughs> um, 10 seconds of battery time. It's not nearly enough. 20 seconds of battery time. Well, slower. Interesting. Uh, right, yes, yeah, so we have several exciting things we're doing today. We have a VIP coming tomorrow. We called the Runaway Seahorses. I believe on our to-do list, the first thing, we've got many missions to turn in. We're going to go check on the record chamber and also try to find... Oh, we should go talk to Bancho first, actually. Okay, let's go talk to Bancho. And then we're going to go try to find that. I think it's a coral trout we also need, if I remember correctly. Many things to do, and then we're gonna go night diving to try get the manta ray shot. Hmm, coral porridge. So I've made before. Yeah, another six C person. Here's the ingredients. All right, hand it over to me. <laughs> Dave's love and admiration for Bancho is adorable. Thanks, Bancho. Take this to see people at the workshop. Okay, so. Oh, we need to feed the cat as well. Hey, Momo. Who's a good kitty? Who's a good kitty? Oh, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy. You're a good kitty. So, you know. Right. Back to the bit. As they say in the clubs. Probably. You don't know. You don't know my life. It hasn't killed time, has it? Nope. Uh, right, so we should be good. We're not going to spend any money because we're saving up for a better harpoon, I believe. So, task one. Oh, God, I hate the spider crap. <laughs> task one is the coral trout, which I believe is... I don't know. I should have checked. <laughs> Retrospect, that would have made more sense. Not sure. Is that on my, can I see it on my list somewhere? Probably not, right? Yeah. No, it's not that one. It's that one. Yeah, 50 to 130. Oh, it's handy that I can actually see that. So, 50 to 130 meters, coral trout, and then the record chamber, and then back down to the depths is the plan to kick things off. And um, we need to murder some things, probably. We always need to murder something, anyway. What we are. Oh, 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 including these lovely fellas over here. I think annoyingly, yeah, I'm gonna be one short. I'd like to imagine they're a couple, you know. Oh god, ah! It is so hard to handle more than one fish at a time. It really, really is. Annoyingly, I'm going to be on nine fried egg jellyfish out of ten on this mission that I've had for about 5,000 years at this point in time. But I got a cheap Japanese sword. I'm feeling sexy. And we also need seaweed as well, if I remember correctly, which I think is only found at 50 meters and deeper. So down we go. Everything we need should be... Oh, I heard the whale. Maybe it's the sound. Sound of a baby humpback. Please take a look around. There must be a baby wheel. Oh, it's this way. It's this way. Get your priorities in order. There's a baby whale that needs me. Is it this way? I think so, yeah. I mean, I think we can all accept that. Even though the other missions have, you know, time constraints, saving the baby whale is clearly the most important thing we could possibly do. I remember this bit. Quang sound coming from behind the pile of rocks. They'll need to be removed. Gonna get you out of there, buddy. Don't know how you got yourself in there, but that's okay. Baby's gonna do what babies do, you know? Full be removed, let's head inside. Oh no. Ah, I don't wanna head to I don't wanna head back to the boat. I guess it doesn't matter. I guess we can head back to the boat. Let me catch some random fish in the area so I don't feel like I've wasted my time entirely. 
because we, we, we can come back in the afternoon. You know, we, we do have more time, so it's not the end of the world. I really not catch human one. Sleepy fishy, sleepy fishy. Probably needed a few of these in three stars anyway. Yeah, we'll just come back in the afternoon. We didn't really have afternoon plans anyway. Not thrilled about this though. I need to get to that record chamber. I need to go talk to the, the sea people. Baby Whale's Cove. Oh yeah, buddy. Something's gonna try to murder me, isn't it? Oh, hello. There's Baby Whale in there. Seems frightened. Should I go comfort it? Oh. <laughs> it's okay. My hands grew to extreme sizes. I think it's still scared. Should I pet it a little? Pat pat. Pat pat. No. Oh. No. Oh. I think it's less scared now. Let's keep on petting it. It's luring me into a trap. Why can't you see this, Dave? Who's a good whale? Who's a good whale? You're a good whale. Scritch scratch under there. Seems to have let its guard down, go to a brighter area, the mum should come, right? Mm -hmm. Need to be careful bringing it back up. Oh, God, I'm tired. I don't even know why. Come on, you. I really should have grabbed some oxygen before. Oh, I mean, I've got my thing if need be. I'd rather not use it, though. It's okay. It's okay. Now, you won't understand what I'm doing, but I'm going to open a weapon chest. <laughs> okay? <laughs> you have to wait for me. What am I going to call you? Oh, Barracuda! Let's get rid of them. I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it. Don't worry about it. This is baby whale's timid. I need to make sure it stays close. Well, I mean, no, I just I just want to loot the Barracuda. For God's sake, right. This whale's causing me havoc already. Come here, buddy. Come on. But now I can't. Oh, that's stupid. I couldn't. I couldn't get close enough to get rid of the barracuda, but the whale won't come closer until I get rid of the barracuda. <laughs> Look safe now. Let's try taking the whale. Right, come on, you. Cost me some uh, full quality barracuda. Not that that really matters whatsoever, but still. I'm gonna tell your mum all about this. Let's get you out of here, buddy. I am mama now. Oh no, that's a lionfish. I have to get rid of them. Yeah, I mean, okay. It's a shame I don't have a mission. Wait, again, how am I meant to get rid of this many lionfish, realistically? And this is why you need like a proper gun, you know? This is all I can think to do. And they're, they're waking back up. Like, if I had, like, a triple axle or something here, you know, I would have obliterated them. It wouldn't have been a problem at all. You kind of have to put them to sleep just for the sake of spreading them out a little bit, you know? <laughs> Get, absolutely <laughs> Get absolutely bombed. <laughs> a little bit of recoil. Oh, fantastic. Oh, God, so many of them. I've had so many missions throughout this game to catch lionfish for the Eco Watcher, and as soon as I'm finished with it, I get a thousand of the bloody things. Oh my god, ah. Bloody Nora. Well, I guess we're serving lionfish tonight. Oh, 
We've got a red lionfish thorn. Interesting. Come on, buddy. Nearly there, pal. Nearly there. Although I'm sure there's something terrifying waiting in the way. <laughs> Wailing in the way. Is that a joke? Oh, look, it's a shark. A white reef shark up there. Unless I defeat the shark, it's not going to follow me. Okay. I don't think this is going to work. Damn. I mean, I swear that one passed right through its body. A lot of vicious fish today. Almost at the surface. Let's go a little bit more. I guess we'll grab this as well. Got the spare weight. Only rank four, though. We've, we've kind of moved on in our lives from the, uh, the reef shark. That's got to be the last thing, right? They're not going to throw, like, a tiger shark at me in the last 20 meters. Right. There we go. Phew, that was dangerous. Looks a bit safer here. Wait a bit and the mum should come. That's not... Whoa, mama. <laughs> I need some help here. <laughs> I can't take on four of them. I probably could, actually. Sharks, what do I do? I'm sure the mum's about to arrive. There she goes. Bam. <laughs> Fantastic. As a baller. You're welcome. Oh, cute. Wow, it's huge. Well, <laughs> mother's love for her offspring. I guess all animals are the same. I feel like I should text my mom later. Yeah, I probably should actually. I don't see why this has to kick us out of the ocean. I feel like I could have probably just kept swimming. I didn't want to, I just didn't want to leave and end up not finding the cave again, you know? <coughs> hmm, I see. I'm glad you took it to its mother. It wasn't easy getting it down. It got so easily frightened. Maybe it didn't like you, that's all. Anyways, don't spend all your time hunting. Try to be more helpful. Oh. Oh, yeah. Poseidon? Looks like a skin. Thumbs up, Banch. Well, let's hunt tuna for. Oh, of course it's tuna time as well. The steel net sent. Oh, there's too much to do. <laughs> steel net sensor trap. Even the swiftest and biggest tuna cannot escape this trap. Secret weapon for today's hunt underwater drone. It took me quite some time to replace the one you broke last time. Very expensive stuff to buy, you know. It was my fault, but the moment I had it. I made a big investment for moments like this. This is what a businessman does. Let me show how to use that. I follow my instructions. Dive in the water. I do not think we are getting the coral trout today. <laughs> Nor do I think we're getting any missions for the sea people done today either. There's just too much going on. We've got tomorrow for this coral trout. It's okay. I guess. Grumble, grumble. Right, what do you want me to do here, buddy? I will swim and something will happen. Tuna! Oh, I see tuna! The fish is. I want to say tuna, and people may find it's like Tuesday, you know? It's just a British thing. I'd love to catch them. Should I use a tool? That, wait, I just want to pick up the urchin. <laughs> Ow. 
<laughs> okay, good to know that's how it works. You fool of a took. Ah! Right, so in the past, you know I've remarked about how we didn't have room. I think that's how we get the bigger ones that we've seen in the past. Get this big tuna without a problem. I'm impressed. Hey, powerful. You ever catch a big fish? Use the drone. Yeah, there we go. Need one of them to keep the grade of your catch. Fish with wounds can't have a high grade. I'll lend that drone to you for now. Basic model. Without any options. Expensive. Bring that to eye dive if you want upgrades. All right. Very cool. Large fish caught with the net can be upgraded using the salvage drone. Right. I'm going to I'm gonna swap back to the net. What did we need for the net? I need more salvage, I think. Ah! <laughs> I don't have any more drones, so. The good thing is as well, I don't have to carry the fish. So I get this big fish. But, um... Wait, I wonder if I can... Let me just try this. I don't think it's going to work. You're feeling very sleepy. You're not feeling that sleepy. Eh. Eh. Can I just straight up catch a tuna? I just want to try, you know, for funsies. No. <laughs> okay. Well, we need more tuna nuts. Don't know how we get more tuna nuts. Maybe we'll find them now in the in the world. I just need to um I need to upgrade this this net gun. I need to swap back to it. I think the net gun's a better idea, generally speaking. Although I suspect you're not meant to catch tuna. Tuna <laughs> with the net gun, I suspect you are meant to use like a special tuna trap, you know. Hey, seaweed, finally. Oh, do I need one more piece? You've been cheeky. Thank you. Are oh, death for me, fate free. Okay, I don't know, but figure it out, I'm sure. It's all good in the hood. I don't know where else it's good. It's probably good in some other places as well, but it's predominantly good in the hood. So we need to key. Oh, that's only level one. I can't be bothered. We really need the salvage. So the the fragments. So I'm gonna prioritize. If it was like a level two or three harpoon, I'd probably swap. But level one in this day and age, Pasha, Pasha, I say. Now, if I remember correctly, the game will point out when I actually end up on the correct... It'll point out the coral trout when we find them, because we need them for the mission. Disassemble... So, we're at 50 meters. We should be able to find the trout. Somewhere. Yeah, trotty, 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 trotty. Where are you? Ow. I need these as well. Oh, that looks, yeah, high quality cat food for the very first time. Surprised, I thought you'd only get that in deeper depths. Got the foot bonus. Well, that might have been the last one we needed for that. Tennis racket. Sure, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> the melee weapons don't feel that useful. Hmm. The bonk hammer. I can see the value of the bonk hammer. Just because, you know, it puts things to sleep. Get okay, some high quality fish. Alright, well, this is the record chamber. Wait, why are there so many fish? Oh. Why are they? I'm gonna catch a few just in case it's something different. What was that? Big eye scat. I think we already had it, but you never know. You never know. Bloody barracuda, man. Appears to be the slab. I should take it to the shrine in the Sea People village. Only because I wanted to be Lara Croft again, and the game's like, well, I'll get, I'm going to give you that Tomb Raider experience. There we go. 
get out of here. Okay, so I think that's all the Sea People missions done. I need to go turn them in, obviously, and we can't do that at night time, so I do need to do that now. But I do want to find the coral trout, because I'm a little worried that I don't want to leave it till tomorrow. Tomorrow's the last day. So, I, you know... If we can find them today, that'd be fantastic. Ah, Lord, oh, that, well, I found them. <laughs> they just happened to be next to the tiger shark. What a coincidence. Tiger shark, is it usually up here? Not really. Go away, man. This goddamn barracuda. It's not really, it's not done anything yet, but it's a factor because I have to keep getting out the bloody way. I'm getting jaws. The hell just happened? Like, I know what happened initially, but why did it go crazy afterwards? There we go. Blood, Nora. What an absolute nightmare you are. Whew. I see. You can, yeah, you can take the whole shark if you've got a spare drone. Nice! Okay. I don't know if that would have been three star because I did have to murder it. Maybe a better Trank Dark can take that on, but still very cool either way. Because I, I have been wondering how you get three stars for some of the, the larger fish, so. Well, now we know. Right. No more screwing up with the trout. They're not using the trout. Gonna grab all these just in case. Just because I really don't know what I've got. I know I've got the photo on my phone, but my phone is on the other side of the bedroom, and I'm obviously not gonna go all the way over, so. <laughs> you know, understandably. Alright. Oh, nice. I'm gonna drop a little bit of weight. Um... I nearly dropped the bloody. What do I need to drop here? How much weight? Uh, four. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. We're going to head all the way down now to the Sea People village. It's a bit of a trek, but um, we're not going to get there again today. So I think this is the right, the right move. And we can hopefully get some scrap along the way and upgrade our dart and yada 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 on net. But yeah, that's 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 my question. So to get a tiger shark, I mean, if I killed it like that, like like if I just if I'd managed to take it there, right? If I'd managed to, if I had a spare drone to the point that I could capture the tiger shark and send it upwards, could I have then? Hello, you're large. Could I have then, um... Would it have been three stars, is the question, I guess. Oh, you know what I wanted. <laughs> Isn't this a shortcut here? No. There's a shortcut somewhere. And I never take the shortcut. That's what I wanted. Um, would it have been three stars? Or do I need to upgrade, like, the hush dart thing? I know I've upgraded it, but maybe if I pick up like weapon enhancement kits and stuff like that and upgrade it further I don't rightly know this is not the right way don't rightly know folks guess we'll find out I mean all we'll do is next time we have a, a spare drone we'll we'll come down and we'll we'll harpoon a shark to death and we'll see what happens basically <laughs> I hope it'll work Obviously. After that one time I got trapped down here, I'm very, very paranoid <laughs> when it comes to the torch. Oh, 
don't need this for anything, but I may as well. I don't think you can usually pick this up, the, um, the coral. I think you can only pick it up when you've got a mission to pick it up. But if I pick it up now, it means I've got it for later. Don't want... You know what? You know what? <laughs> I'll take the bloody chicken, all right? If you got... Yeah, nothing I care about. So I have a little poker... Ah! It's kind of more what I was looking for. Like, I wouldn't have murdered you if you just left me alone. Go away, man! <laughs> like, we would have been fine together, buddy. Actually, I need to kill these for the, um... For the eco thing, I forgot. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I do feel a little guilty, though. I don't really want to carry it with me. Hmm, still can't get in, though. That's interesting. Meh. Yeah. I don't, I don't really have the spare weight right now. Always have weight for a starfish, though. And a pink seashell. I just always assume I need a pink seashell, and it's always the case. <laughs> it's, it's never not been true that I need a pink seashell. Like, I'd like to catch that, but there's no point in doing it without the drone, right? My make an exception. I don't know where I am, by the way. <laughs> like, I thought I was coming the right way, but that's clearly not the case. Um, I don't really need the Barracuda. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, didn't mean to do that either. Wow. <laughs> Terrible mistakes all over the place. Fantastic. I think this is the right way. I'm just trying to go down. Like, if I just point myself downwards and keep moving in that direction, eventually we'll end up somewhere good. I think this is it, actually. Oh, there we go. That's the last one we needed as well. We also need to find some fang fish if we can spot them. Oh. <laughs> Stop picking up that corpse. Any fangies knocking around? No. What are you again? Not oh, thank you anyway. Alright, let's grab this and then we'll head down and we will be done. Yeah, I think the leveled up net guns just catch more fish, which isn't necessarily a good thing. I can't. Um, really just trying to keep under that 94. It's very tight, but we're still there. I don't know how you get these. There's something in these rocks. It keeps happening. Oh, this is this is what I needed. This dude. Need five of these, I think. Gotta die eventually, buddy. Wait, what? Oh. God, there's another room. Look at this big shiny son of a gun. I'll catch some of these. Again, I really need uh, fragments, so... This is the only reason you have to die, buddy. If you were just a bit more chill, I'd leave you alone. You have to be a nerd about it. I'm not going to need a harpoon again, so let's just... Have this little dude. God, oh, this is uh, much heavier than I thought it was. Um, <laughs> Jesus. I'm nothing if not efficient, <laughs> clearly. <laughs> efficient? Okay, I can't make that joke more than once. I've already done it twice. This is no pork place. I'll stop now. <laughs> right, where did this have to go? I don't really remember. Let's chat to everyone. More earthquakes. Your face should be stronger during times like these. 
one, wasn't he? Don't remember who needed it, but that's okay. Well, it's a question mark, so she bleeds over here. Exclamation point means quest. Question mark means quest completion. Everyone knows that. Oh, yes, this is it. Thank you so much. Haha, -ha. I can finally provide proper food to my customers. I'd like to hear about you humans too, so drop by to, drop by to chat every now and then. Thanks, love. Okay, only 25 credits to go, so I think we're probably going to get it. We've got the seahorse one to turn in. We've got the porridge one to turn in. We should make it. We've got a bit of buy. I don't know what we used to buy for, but we've got a bit of buy. I've got four missions to turn in. Jesus. I've been a busy little mongoose. I'm going to go over here first. Go to the temple. Not been to the temple in a long time, man. Definitely, I, I'm still not sure about the blue whistle, but if I had like several hundred by, I'd probably throw seven on this, yeah. But, you know, when we've only got 50, seven's quite a large percentage, so. My goodness, human, this is the one. Thankness, thanks to you, we'll be able to have the wedding without any hiccups. Nice. Oh, human, or rather Dave, wasn't it? I think if you participated, you could become better acquainted with the villagers. See people wedding, huh? That sounds interesting. It does. But the sea people want to be called the sea people. Wouldn't they just be called the people? And then the land people would be called the land people. Anyways, here we are, Dave. Feels different from a human wedding. <laughs> Is that so? You can stay in the back. He'll begin soon. Aww. Oh no, the earthquake. What is causing that? Is it the it can't be the Kraken. It could be the Kraken. King Long! Another earthquake! King Long's arm! Oh. Terrible news. Oh dear, King Long, this is terrible. It's actually a very old statue. We don't have tools in the village to patch it up. Oh dear, this is not good. Is it an omen of an impending disaster, perhaps? Hey now, calm down. <laughs> Maybe Cobra will have something. I'll try and see if there's anything we can use on the surface. Just wait a bit. Oh, Dave, please do bring back something. King Long, we need your protection. We need Dave's protection. I'm the one who's saving everything. <laughs> hey, kids. Oh, I got the ball for the kids. It's the ball. You brought it back for us. It was real scary. You kids stay inside the village from now on, okay? Okay. Oh, she's adorable. Guess humans aren't all bad, like what we were told. Hope to see you again, human. I'm basically like an emissary, you know? Right, we should... We should turn the quest in first. In case, um... Because I've got 100 out of 100 credit. So I don't want to like turn in quest. Like maybe I need more credit, you know what I mean? So we should turn in the quest first in case there's going to be another bar to fill. And maybe it's not going to stack up if we do it now. Big brain. Denzin! He looks very happy with me <laughs> in the bottom right. It seems the villagers seem to crush, trust you quite a lot. I'd first like to thank you for everything you've done for our village. Seems everyone's friendly then, I thought. I don't trust you fully just yet, but we could use all the help we can get right now. Let me explain to you about this village a bit. Did you see the tree at the centre of the village? Yes, it was huge and covered in ice. Yes, we call it the Divine Tree. Use the fruit of this tree as an energy source. That must be a thing in... Korea, Japan, some part of Asia, because I see that as quite a common motif. It's kind of a thing like that in Lies of P as well, but it's a money tree. The tree has its roots far below the bottom, using the geothermal heat to create energy. Maybe it's just based on the Yggdrasil. Because the fruits are created from this energy, there's a giant glacier under this tree that is under our village. A glacier on the sea bottom. Never heard of such a thing. As of late, the heat coming from deep in the earth has grown hotter, melting the ice slowly. As the temperature of the tree increases, more and more villagers are falling ill. We keep praying to King Long, but, but we know things aren't as simple as that. We need to check on the glacier below the surface. We've relied on only agriculture for so long, we don't have the equipment or the technology to explore down there. Embarrassing as it is. That's why I told you we need the human's help. I must admit that now is our only option, my daughter. In any case, I know it's a difficult task, but will you check out the glacial area below the village? Sounds very dangerous, but alright. A bit more tremors on the surface as well, I think this might all be connected somehow. Thank you, we'll be sure to recompense you somehow. Now then, you'll need the key down to the glacial passage, to the key. Where is that key? Denzin! When we sealed the glacial passage, we put the key inside the abandoned cave, remember? Oh dear, you're right. 
I sense something's not right again. Even Dave's like sick of video game nonsense. <laughs> Go get the key from the abandoned cave. Suwan will take you there. Not dangerous, is it? Ha <laughs> ha, nothing's happened there for the last century. No one's been there for a century. Anyways, we need to find out what's going on in the glacier zone before it's too late. It's getting late. Come back tomorrow when the sun is up. Suwan will guide you on this path. Okay. That sound, you know, the glacier zone. That sounds, you know, I said in the last video, I think it was. Or the video before, the video before, but I did get the feeling we'll be going to other places, other oceans. Maybe this is one of them. The glacier zone. Don't know how you're going to justify an underwater. I mean, yeah, I can kind of see it. Eh, not really, but whatever. Onwards. Doesn't look like we've got another trust meeting. Maybe we'll get one down the line, but I'm not going to not turn the quests in, you know. We get some bye, if nothing else. Oh, this is coral porridge. You should eat it and rest. Hmm. How can a human make our food? Put it there and go. I have to check if it's poisoned. What an unreasonable sea person. <laughs> I mean, not really. <laughs> Again, I think that's a fairly legitimate feeling. I guess I should be thankful for the porridge. Yeah! Damn right. But also check if it's poisoned. You know, it's okay to do both. If I was going to poison someone... I'd want them to be thankful for the poison. You know what I mean? Actually, that does happen. Because, as, as you know, poisoning is typically how women murder people. Much more than how men murder people. So, a woman... And, and you know what? It's kind of rooted in the patriarchy. Because it just means the woman's doing all the cooking. And that's the only reason they get away with it. <laughs> well, well, you put back all the seahorses. Quite difficult to find. <laughs> we can now resume seahorse races. Can I participate in the seahorse race? Give you a seahorse and thanks for your help. Wow, where can I get one? Go speak to Yami, you find in front of the race course. Hope to see you around the game parlor, human. I have a ridiculous crush on Lynch. <laughs> Wait, are you Yami? Oh my, you're the human. I'm Yami. I'm in charge of the seahorse race course. Ha ha. Heard you caught the seahorses that ran off. Thank you so much for that. I heard from Lynch already. We'll give you a nice strong seahorse as a gift for your efforts. Jayaka seahorse. Okay. Can I race my seahorse? Wow, I've seen many seahorses like this elsewhere as well. Can they also race here? Of course, bring them to me. I'll register them for the races. Why don't you try register? Okay. That's where you can register seahorses you've caught for the races. Why don't you try it? Okay. It's like the race menu to get ready for the... Okay. Okay. This is where you can select the course and begin a race. I suggest, suggest selecting course C for starters. Okay, so we're, when we catch Seahorse in the wild, we're going to get stronger ones that are more ready to race. This way you can see the participants and check who you're up against. Select the Seahorse. This way you select the Seahorse. Salmon is really important. Make sure you take the arrow on the right. Once Seahorse race, they need to rest to recover the stamina. You should have several Seahorse ready. Okay. Let's go, let's rock it. Do I need to do anything? Cheer to increase the speed. If your gauge goes past the green, you slow down, so be careful. The great attempt to rate, okay. Don't know which one's mine. <laughs> oh, it's the closest one. Alright, so I'm trying to maintain this sort of speed here. You got this, buddy. You got this. Slightly annoying because I can't look at my seahorse. <laughs> I really have to stay staring at the bottom. If I'm gonna get this right. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You got this, you got this, pal. You got this, you and me. Yeah, there we go. Again, just a whole new mechanic of minigame and everything. Yeah. Nice. Pretty quiz as well. Dave's loving it. Okay. So, I don't need seahorse on me. Why do I wait? Why do I not have any seahorse on me? Oh, I must have to get them. I don't know. Do you reckon I have to get them like now? As in, I, if I go catch a seahorse, I have to go catch a seahorse in the wild now. Bring it back. Like I can't, because obviously I've caught seahorse before. Um, but it doesn't seem to count. 
Uh, should we just leave, by the way? I don't I don't think there's anything I need to do down in the ocean, right? You know, look, I, I kind of nailed it. <laughs> Did so much in this little expedition. Right, so let's, uh, let's take the mirror back out. Oh, we've got a bit of money building up. The sea people like me. I've got to imagine there's more quests on the way. There's a request board, for example. I guess it's just how you earn some money, but I'm hoping I can kind of just learn how to use some mini games, and that's how I'll make my cash more than anything. But we shall see. Hmm, stone adhesive for use underwater. Let's see. Oh, good. It's in the corner. This should do. We should go back to the village and attach the armor to King Long Statue. Do that tomorrow. There we go. Look at that tuna. Nine. Yeah, lovely. Thumbs up, Banch. <laughs> what do you want? What's up? Storm is getting rowdy. Tonight, the creature that gives the super rare boss card will most likely appear. Doesn't it excite you as a Marinka collector? Not really. Oh, -ho, go in the evening. You'll see the vortex that was created by the storm. You'll find the creature once you go inside the vortex. I would go with my diary skills. We're better. It's too bad. I wish you luck. Ho, ho, ho. Okay. Well, we needed to go diving again anyway, because we're going to try to find the, um, the manta ray. So I guess that's two reasons. Now there are two reasons. Find the whirlpool. Okay. Well, first of all, let's weapon shop. Upgrade. Oh. Oh, I can upgrade the net gun, though. Which is exciting. A lot of money, but... I know I can skip it, but it makes me happy. I, I, I am not an anime fan by any stretch of the imagination, but I quite like the cheesy, that kind of anime music. It does make me happy. I don't know why. There's a song, um, these are, I don't know how many of you used to hang around on Newgrounds when it was a thing. It was very much a thing when I was a kid, like a young teen. Newgrounds, and it was like flash animations and stuff like that. It's the kind of website that's, like, I'm sure it still exists. But it used to be a big part of the culture, and it just isn't anymore because Twitter and Facebook and Reddit and all of those and TikTok and that has kind of, I would suggest, supplanted traditional websites in that kind of manner. Which is kind of sad. Um, your know, websites, inverted commas, don't really exist anymore in a weird way. But there was a, I think it was Happy Birthday. It might have been part two. Well, there was a song called Happy Birthday. And like a, a music video someone had done about this rabbit. And it just made me really happy. It's like the stupidest little thing, but it, it brought great joy. <coughs> Anyways, net gun fully upgraded. Uh, we've got some new marinkas over here. Yeah, I thought so. The, the grouper and the, the mackerel I very specifically triple starred last time around. We've got the tuna. Looks like there might be another type of tuna. Okay, and Eco Watcher. Lovely. Get more fossils. It's not really something we focus on, it just kind of happens naturally over time. Except this bloody seaweed one, which I just can't seem to do. It really annoying me. Uh, right, yeah, and I Diver, so we've got a new thing now with the Salvage Drone. Bloody hell. 6,300, that's vicious. Alright. I wasn't going to do it anyway, but... Let's go diving. Bloop, bloop. Maybe we can catch more tuna? I don't really know how this works. How we, How do I get the tuna? It's so pretty at night. How do I get the the net thing that catches the, you know, the, 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 the tuna trap? I understand the drone thing, but how do I get the trap? I'm hoping for, no, I was hoping for a, um, I'm, I'm pretty sure we're about to get a boss fight, right? <laughs> so. Whenever we find the vortex, so I was kind of hoping for a um, I'm ho I'm looking for a harpoon upgrade if we can find one. But anyway, how do we get the the tuna trap? Let me load. I think I just caught the exact same ones all over again. God damn it. God damn it. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, we're gonna have a lot of these. We'll we'll have to level this recipe up and do some cooking with them because that's a lot of <laughs> a lot of a single fish. It's so annoying because like this is the upgraded net and it still doesn't catch them all, you know. Oh, that's a vortex. Hmm. Okay, what have you got for me, weapon box? Please be something good. Nope, rubbish. Fantastic. I might I might just skip that for now. <laughs> have a little poke around. Actually, you know, the main thing I was worried about was my oxygen, so if I grab this first, I'm going to back myself to take on whatever's in there. Let's go find out. Here we go. Dangerous creature's presence. Oh, God. When the Vortex ended up here, maybe these things that got caught in a storm and disappeared. The big truck just moved. Okay. Well, there's ammo for the neck. I'm not sure. I mean, I don't know how helpful that's going to be. We're, we're going to rely on our level 1 harpoon for this battle. Because we are large of brain. Wow. I've got a cheap Japanese sword. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a crab, isn't it? I'd a guess. It reminded me of Dredge, you know, when the crabs would use the, um... The boats. That's a... That's a shell. Alright. Moving truck. It's not a truck, it's a giant hermit crab. I don't think a gun's gonna do anything. What do I do? Oh. Wait, a gun's not gonna do anything? Oh lord, it's coming! Oh lord! Aha! Wait, now what? I was gonna hit me twice. Ow! Stop! <laughs> I don't know what I don't. Right, I, I see. I think it must be. I'm picking these up, but is that wrong? Explosive barrels. It's gotta be important, right? Just keep swimming into them and nothing happens. I need to push it back a little bit. Get juked, crab! Oops. Ah, sort of. Do I just lure him into the barrel? I don't know what to do. I don't understand. Does something. Ow. What's the benefit of that, though? Oh, now I can pick up the barrel. <laughs> um, I guess. Wait, can I? Why could I not do this a minute ago? Huh? That didn't work. Okay, that's fine. You say that. that that's fine. I'm gonna die because the game was broken. Basically, that's what I'm saying. Here. Crap. All right, come in. Yeah. So you want to do that first? Just uh make him hide away. I probably only need to hit him one more time. Because it's a video game. Oh, come on! What do you want from me? 
there any air in here? This is bullshit, by the way. <laughs> this is so unjust. Like, I don't think I've messed up here at all. I think the game has just been a disaster. For God's sake, the... I'm, gonna, I'm just going to die. Ah... <sighs> Oh, can we start? Thank God for that. That was annoying. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm, I'm frustrated. It's like I kept swimming towards them, and nothing happened. They just they just vanished into the ether, you know. And then I dropped one on his head, and nothing happened then either. For God's sake! How am I meant to ah? Stay there. <laughs> Bam. Get wrecked, nerd. No point in doing it that time. <laughs> Interestingly enough, you, you respawn and the oxygen that was on the ground disappears. <laughs> like, so technically, the second time is harder than the first. That was that, no man, shut up. Come on, gotta try to hit me, buddy. I kinda hoping I'd manage to chuck that just in time. But I did not. You got this, Dave. Dave, you don't have this. Dave is going terribly badly. We got this. You really have to. You have to be quite far to the right, I think, for this to work. Come on, there we go. Blood. I was like, I'm getting so annoyed again. <laughs> get this O2. I mean, that's the first game over I've had from a boss. The bosses have not been difficult. It must be said, generally speaking. Did I pick up both? <laughs> Ah! I'm trying to, because, you know, if you throw things in the right direction, um, well, like, momentum counts when you're throwing things, right? Oh, we didn't do it, okay. But fine, like, we've got so much O2 that this isn't that risky, you know, generally speaking. Go, F, ow. I'm trying to, you have to hit me. Hit me. Thank you. No, you're not actually meant to hit me, but you're meant to try to hit me. I wish I had a gun for this. Like, the sniper rifle would be so helpful here. Swim, Dave, swim! Is that not it? There we go. Oh, it's not over. But I hit it three times, and it's a video game. <laughs> I don't understand. Oh! He's learning! Got my rift over six times. Oh, come on, man! Happened again! Hit. That was a good hit there. Oh no, I'm actually I'm actually I'm actually in a lot more trouble than I realized. I need to bait him forward a little bit first. I need to bait out the hit. I need to get two more hits. I'm, it's going to be tight. I've got 6702 left. Uh. Oh, I did it. Five hits. Maybe I didn't do it. I did it. That was tough. I think it was really moving. Nothing about the shell. Oh, the boss card Sato was talking about has been activated. That was, that was a toughie. Mainly because the game was a bit bugged, but still, a piece of hermit crab pincer came off. Should I pick up a piece? And I knew before I came here that realistically what I should have done 
is swap out the net gun for something else. You know, I should have brought... Um, I should have brought an axle or a sniper rifle or something like that. Now, don't send me back to the boat. I've got other things to do, man. Um, logically, I should have used a different gun. Oh, nice, I didn't. Okay, cool. Right, well, we can carry on and try to find this manta ray as well. And uh, more importantly, find some bloody O2 somewhere. That was very close. If the, if the boxes hadn't disappeared, I think I probably would have done it first time. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if that's true, but I feel like that's true. I'm never sure that's going to work. It always makes me a little bit nervous. I'm going to come back for you in a minute, buddy, because I think you're new. I don't think you're the same shark. But I don't have any bloody O2, and there just isn't any... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't know what it is about nighttime, but they definitely limit the amount of O2 knocking around. It feels way more dangerous than it does in daytime. I can't find any. Like, there just isn't any. Maybe there isn't. Maybe that's the thing at nighttime that there's no O2 lying around. It's slightly annoying, because obviously I wouldn't have done it. Nah, I'm not going to get the mana this much time, am I? Obviously things would have gone differently if I hadn't had to suffer through that bloody boss fight. <laughs> I could get an O2 thing here. Eh, alright. I guess we can chill for a little bit. So aggressive. Go away. Oh, there's an O2 thing here. Oh, I wish I hadn't used my... Go away! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Demon! Demon! And you're different as well. You're purple. I've not seen a purple lionfish before. Oh, maybe I have a clear friend. Yeah, I think I have. Never mind. I'm talking nonsense. Leave me alone. Bloody Nora. Now we can swim around with a little bit more abandon. I really just partly do that. Just, just, just so they leave me alone, you know? Let's grab this. How are we doing on time? Yeah, we're near the end, aren't we? Well, we'll have this little exploration. I want to go take on that shark. I'm not convinced from looking at it. It looks it doesn't look like a white tip, it looks like a black tip. I think it's a different shark. So I'm gonna go murder it and see what happens. Oh no, I don't wanna murder it. Oh wait, well actually this is no this is how we're gonna test. Because I've got a drone, right? So I can kill the shark and then We can send it back by the drone. It's definitely not the same as the other one, because it's taking several more hits to kill. The other one definitely would have been dead by now. There we go. So can I... There we go. Hello, buddy! Off you, Pop. <laughs> That's very cool. Yeah, still, you see what I mean? It's still only a two-star, because I had to use the... A harpoon to kill it, and that, you know, ruins it a little bit. So, I don't know, do you need the trank gun for that situation then? Because I can't net a shark like that, or do you need those traps that we had for the tuna that I don't know how to get? This is the question. Mysteries abound, ladies and gentlemen. I need to find some bloody ammo is what I need. Are they new up there on the left? They might, they, it looks like it's a shoal, obviously, so it looks like the other ones, but they don't look the same. It looks different. No, it doesn't look different. The 
these obnoxious little monsters. I did see the O2, I just wanna don't wanna use it quite yet. I am curious that we've never really been deep. We've never been this deep even during like a nocturnal session. I don't know where this manta ray is. I don't know if there's any indication whatsoever that the manta ray that we're gonna know where it is. We should be able to find some new stuff. Like that is a cuttlefish, but it's got this like... First of all, it's aggressive, because everything's aggressive. But yeah, it's, got, it's a spear squid. That's cool. That's new. Got some more cat food. Priorities. Let's see what else. Whoa! Don't want to see the tiger shark. We've seen a tiger shark before. They're not that exciting. Well, they are pretty exciting, but I don't need to see more tiger sharks. Double skeleton. Nice. That'd be nice. Let's grab this. We're not going to come back this way. Let's just avoid the bloody tiger shark, shall we? Purple. Out of curiosity. God, they're trying to. These don't usually try to. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Leave me alone. Nah. See, this is the problem with the net. What is the point in the net when this happens? I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I'm done. I'm out. Whoa. Oh. The net can't even catch those bloody things, and that's the max level net. I just, I don't understand. There must be tools and stuff we can get to trap bigger things. Or we have to upgrade the, I don't bloody know. Well, ah, you found the super red boss card. Astounding, you must be a natural born Marinka collector. The sea was unrelenting, all those terrifying sea creatures. That was serious stuff. Ha <laughs> ha, no big deal compared to this awesome super red boss card. What for all that? Now, tap share card with friends like this. There we go, keep up the good work. Ho ho. Do I get a reward for that? <laughs> Thumbs up, Banch. No, <laughs> apparently not. I mean, we got the Super Red Boss card, which is cool. Yeah, there's our Spear Squid. And there's our Truck Hermit Crab. That's cool. What do we do on this one? Ah, oh, the seaweed. Weirdly enough, I've been fighting for the seaweed for ages. Uh, again, it is seaweed that we need, yeah. Five more seaweed to go. Still not even halfway. <laughs> you went to the Sea People Village, right? Yeah, wild exists. Something like dangerous going on. Probably related to all the recent earthquakes. Hmm, have been a lot of earthquakes. Okay, whatever. Uh, right, I think we are done. So we will go open the restaurant next video. Uh, let me check my to-do list. We're going to get the rice. So tomorrow we're going to get the rice in the morning, hopefully. Um, and then we'll serve the VIP in the evening. I'm going to try to figure out what we're doing with the tuna. And we need to go back to the Sea People Village. And then we also need to dive again at night in order to um, try to get this manta ray thing. But nighttime is spooky time. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so we'll start off next episode by opening up the restaurant day. Thank you for joining me. Cheers much of as always. Bye-bye.